So, we will see various air standard cycles. We will see the Carnot cycle, Auto cycle, Diesel cycle, Dual cycle, Sterling cycle, and Ericsson cycle. We will see the same First, we will see the Carnot cycle. We will see the cycle in the Carnot cycle. We will see PV diagram and TS diagram. We will use the efficiency calculate. So first car note cycle is not going to be different process. The first process is 1 to 2 that is isothermal expansion, 2 to 3 isentropic expansion or isentropic can be called as reversible adiabatic and in some text अदु वर्दे आड़ेबाटी के नहीं दम but अदु एक करकटन हो रही है ना तो आइडर वी मस्ट राइट इट लाइक रिवर्सिबल आड़ेबाटी और आइसेंट्रोपिक इन अन्य आना तो मेंशन जाए इन्दर and three to four is आइसोथर्मल कंप्रेशन four to one is आइसेंट्रोपिक और रिवर्सिबल आड़ेबाटी कंप्रेशन so, this is the calculation of the efficiency of the cycle, the air standard efficiency. This is all the cycles we have done. So, we need to know what is the efficiency of an air cycle. Efficiency is nothing but. This is what we call it common. For all the cycles we have done, that is the output by input. It is the efficiency of any cycle. Here, output means net work done. And input is what we call it in any range as heat energy. So, input is heat supplied. So, what is work done? We have learned second law of thermodynamics. We have a high temperature reservoir in heat absorb or heat supply. That is a low temperature reservoir in heat reject. So, we have a circle where the output work is done. The work done is equal to heat supplied minus heat rejected. Using that same phenomenon, here work done divided by, work done can be replaced as heat supplied minus heat rejected. Work done is what? Heat supplied minus heat rejected divided by heat supplied, which will be equal to 1 minus heat rejected by heat supplied. So, this is efficiency of any cycle. Cycle efficiency is given by 1 minus heat rejected divided by heat supplied. So, नम्मल इनी एद वर cycle analysis इन एड़ित्त आलियों, we have to observe where the heat supply process is taking place and heat rejection process is taking place. So, इवड नम्मल पारण्यू, नाल प्रोसस वोंड़ इदिने नम्मक इनी वर PV डायगरत्तिलों, TS डायगरत्तिलों इनने रप्रसेंडेटिया. 1 to 2 process being an expansion process. अवड़ प्रेशर डिक्रीस ही है ना वॉल्यूम इंक्रीस ही है ना प्रेशर डिक्रीस ही है ना इधर तारों टू मोड़ना वॉल्यूम इंक्रीस मींस द लाइन हैव टू मूव्स टुवर्ड्स द राइट साइड सो दैट उरे कर्व इंगेन ना हमको गिट्टनो वन टू टू प्रोसेस रिप्रेजेंट्स आइसोथर्मल एक्सपेंशन प्रोसेस नो टू टू now, 3 to 4 is compression process, so that compression process either or no, pressure must increase, may load to bottom and volume must decrease. Now, 4 to 1 process is, 2 to 3 process is isentropic expansion, 3 to 4 is isothermal compression, 4 to 1 is again isothermal, sorry, 4 to 1 is isentropic compression. अब इधर ने हमारा PV diagram, इन PV diagram ने हमारा expansion और compression का मात्रा observe ये था हमारी, इन्हीं आदिन डे मुन्ने वाला word that is isothermal, isentropic याद है लाइन importance वाली ना हमारा TS diagram तो लाना, and first one is isothermal process means temperature is remaining constant, so 1 to 2 that is T1 is equal to T2 and 2 to 3 process is isentropic process which means that entropy is remaining constant so that 2 to 3 process will be straight line that is S2 will become equal to S3 
because uh, yes, entropy at point 2 is equal to entropy at point 3 be because that is isentropic process. Now, 3 to 4 is again 3 to 4 is isothermal compression. Isothermal means temperature must remain constant. So, that T3 becomes equal to T4 and 4 to 1 process is isentropic process means 4 to 1 S4 must be equal to S1. So, we have PV diagram I, TS diagram I. Next, we need to find the heat rejection process and heat supply process. And we have to say isentropic process is otherwise called as reversible adiabatic process. Very important concept. Clear I to distinguish what is an adiabatic process, what is reversible adiabatic process and what is an isentropic process. This must be very clear. Adiabatic process means no external heat loss that is Q is equal to 0. Now, what is reversible adiabatic process? That is, now we heat engine assume. A heat engine is a piston and that is reciprocated. We are supplying some amount of heat. That is reciprocated in the heat that we have to go to the surroundings. That means no external losses. What is the process? It is an adiabatic process because System in Agathan, very low heat on them, reject the other process near them, adiabatic process in the Varainada. Now, what is reversible adiabatic? E piston Agatha cylindroid reciprocate in the Samayatha, E piston or cylinder in the wall silicone of Poem, there is friction. So, because of this friction, Namal either completely reversible process out in the Taro to Boy, Tirichan Namal compress either the Gainal, either then the initial state load Irikilla Poem, because compression Narakan the Samayatha. Uh, because of the friction existing inside that a temperature of gas we expansion the pinna compress temperature lot which means that avada nadanad oru reversible process alla appo itre ullu nammada because of friction effect ee nadakkuna process even though adinagathu oru heat loss on ee heat loss porathottu illengi polum adinagathu friction ulladhu kaaranam it's not a reversible process ipo adinagathu friction illengil that is no internal heat loss internal item losses on the illengil reversible adiabatic process on the which is called the isentropic process so in an isentropic process no external losses and no internal losses as in the form of friction for friction will external item heat to bone the lingi namaka complete heat in a namak useful work i to matter and patim and all our concept lana isentropic process is a very pure reversible process on the para in other so, I hope the difference between an adiabatic process and a reversible adiabatic process is clear. Now, see, here, uh, now, adiabatic process, there is no heat transfer associated with it. So, in 2 to 3 process, Q equal to 0 and 4 to 1 process also Q equal to 0. Here also, Q to 2 to 3 and 4 to 1. 4 to 1 process, 3 to 2 process, we have Q equal to 0. And now, we need to identify heat supplied process and heat rejection process. We have to high temperature lighting heat is supply. So, 1 to 2 is a heat supply process. Heat supply and 3 to 4 is heat rejection process. We have to learn about the Carnot cycle. That is normally we use Q is equal to MC delta T equation. Q is equal to MC delta T. We have to apply the heat in the equation. But we have to apply the Carnot cycle. Reason is, here, if you look at these two processes, 1 to 2 and 3 to 4, delta T is also 0. So, if you look at this, here is Q0 and here is Q0. Eventually, we have to calculate the heat and efficiency. So, that we have to use this technique. Q is equal to MC delta T cannot be used for a Carnot cycle. So, we are going to know there is a technique. We are going to learn the thermodynamics and the area under PV diagram will give work done. Similarly, the area under TS diagram will give the heat transfer. So, that other exploit is 1 to 2 in Agathola entire area represents the heat supplied. That is equal to this height. Total height is T1 into this width S2 minus S1 gives the amount of heat supplied. And heat rejected will be equal to this thing T3 into this width that is S3 minus S4. Above, the efficiency of Carnot cycle can be calculated using the formula 1 minus 
T3 into S3 minus S4 divided by T1 into S2 minus S1. 